Hey everybody, KO 1214 here, back for another exciting episode of The Legend of Spyro, Dawn of the Dragon. So, in the last episode, we faced off against the Golem, uh, repelled it twice, and met up with Hunter, the badass cheetah. So, here we go, continuing into the catacombs. Here goes another cutscene. Hunter, give us a moment to gather our strength. You might want to stand back. This can get weird. It is fascinating how your kind draws strength from these crystals. Dragons are truly remarkable. Yeah, you say that now, till one tries to kill you. And by one, I mean her. I am aware of Cinder's past, but Ignitus trusts her, and that's good enough for me. Go on, Cinder. Trippy light effect. Spyro, as a rare partner dragon, you can wield many abilities that others cannot. Now it is time to awaken these powers within you. Fire, electricity, ice, and earth. Cinder, while most other dragons can master only a single element, your exposure to the darkness has gifted you with abilities most uncommon. Poison, fear, wind, and shadow. That was a chronicler right there. Okay, so this big green thing right here will restore your elemental energy so that you can use elements and stuff and yeah here we go more of these little things okay, you know I said Hunter was badass but you know that's a way like a scared cat when you get into a battle okay so for the powers uh let's see okay well right now you only have one attack in each uh, thing so fire you just catch enemies on fire. Uh, ice. You can freeze enemies. Electricity. You shoot. You shoot lightning bolts that can chain between enemies. And earth. You turn into a ball or something. Okay, so that's all Spyro's elements. Now for Cinder. Uh Ah oh, jeez. Don't let them surround you. Uh poison. Shoot balls of poison that po actually poison the enemies. Uh wind. You can pick up enemies and throw them around. Uh, shadow, you can go underground and attack from beneath. And last, fear, in my opinion, is one of the best powers. You shoot out shockwaves, make enemies afraid of you. And actually being afraid of you does do damage to enemies. Yeah, see, I just took that one out by making him afraid of me. Okay, but anyway, if I'm not mistaken, there is a secret down here. Uh, just more experience. Is that really all? Oh, nope, looks like there's something. Okay, and I was wrong. There is nothing. I was just trying to drag you away. Okay, I'm just gonna switch to Spyro and torch all these people. I love using that power. Just catching them on fire. Okay, now I show off that attack I was trying to show off earlier. 
Okay, that wasn't it. Man, I keep on messing up. Okay. Ah. Okay, never mind. I just killed all the enemies. Oh, wait, nope. There you do it! Battle rape! Yes! I love that attack. It's so random. God, I'm such a perv. But first off, when you see these vines, uh, you need, one of you spirals fire breath on them. They'll retreat, and you can just get health upgrades. You get health crystals. Not that great. Uh. Okay, I thought there's something in there, but there's nothing. Okay, so anyway, uh, no, not over there. Go up to where Hunter is, and you use your fire breath again. There's a treat, so you can go on. Okay. Oh, and there's the first experience crystal right there. Okay, so that gives you 100 experience each, and slightly restores your health and stuff. So that leads me to the next thing I gotta cover. It can actually upgrade the elements to learn more attacks and stuff. So, let's see... I'm gonna upgrade Earth, because that's one of your best powers when it's fully upgraded. Upgrade Cinders, uh, Fear is her best power when fully upgraded. Okay, so each one of those little slots there... Uh, earns you a level up when they're completely filled. And I'm pretty sure there's something over here. Okay, looks like I was wrong again. But anyway, oh, I know where something is. Yes, I think I do. Um, yes. Yeah, this is the first health upgrade, and I failed. Okay, let me try that again. Okay, I'm in a wind tunnel right now, so I can just break out of that. Okay. That thing's really hard to get to, because it's at a place where you actually start to fall if you go too far out. Because, of course, Spyro can't fly that high. Okay, I'm going to gain a little height with the wind tunnel. Oh, God, it's caught me. Okay, you know what? We got a lot done here. We beat the whole other horde of enemies, found the first experience crystal. So, you know what? I'm just gonna end this here in the next one. Hopefully, I'll have gotten it. So, yeah. So, until then, see you guys next time. If you like this video, uh, hit the big yellow button up in the right corner to subscribe. Give me a five star review down below. And I'll see you guys next time when we'll finally get that health crystal. Okay, see you guys later.